more and more people are going to be aware of what's happening in the non-physical so there's this cleanup in the astral right now because all of the manipulation that has been taking place is taking place in the fourth dimension so all these rituals all of this uh, manipulation of time manipulation of our perception of reality programming so we're manifesting certain things as a collective utilizing the collective consciousness to harvest energy and manifest or the collective unconscious um, so all of that is kind of being cleared up it's coming up to the surface that's why a lot of things are going to be coming out and it's really just creating a new reality it's like we're kind of hopping from one dimension to another dimension but the place in between has to be cleared because that's what's been holding us back so the fourth dimension needs to be cleared. That's why we've been doing all of this clearing and purging and having to be fully aware of our thoughts and our emotions in every moment and going through um, all of these triggers and integrating. That's because of this clearing with the fourth dimension that's kind of blocking us from being able to move forward as a collective. And that's where all these thought forms are and these um, elemental energies that have taken on an active intelligence. So because we've been fueling these certain thoughts and emotions within the collective, mainly through manipulation and programming, we've been fueling these energies and they become active intelligence in the astral realm. So it's almost like we created these monsters or these entities that have an intelligence of their own. No soul, but they can attach to an energy and they can feed off of that. So this is how people actually sell their souls, that saying. It's through that process. So we're having to battle this, these energies or entities that have been created through us fueling them as a collective for thousands of years. <laughs> so it's a lot of work. Mm -hmm. So I'll just say hi to you guys in the chat real quick and then I'll probably be heading to bed. I'm going to be going on Patreon live um, tomorrow. I plan on going on, I believe, around 6 o'clock. So if any of you are on Patreon, and we'll do um, a Shakti transmission and meditation, just a little chat. Oh yeah, synchronicities, I think I already said that, but synchronicities are just going to be out of control. They're going to speed up, they're going to be like more numbers, but, but beyond the numbers, everything's just going to feel like it's connecting to the next thing. Um, it's all going to start making sense too with synchronicities over this next year for a lot of people. So the things that you've been experiencing that you don't you don't really know what they mean with certain synchronicities and certain people, that's going to start unfolding more in this next year, this galactic year, which is nice. I do have an Instagram, but I don't really go on it. I'll, I'm going to start going on it more, though. <laughs> I didn't know it's been the whole thing. I like that. <laughs> <laughs> 